hi guys welcome back to another tutorial so guys if you're new to this channel welcome if you are not yet subscribed please do not forget to click that subscribe button and make sure to click the notification bell to be notified each time i drop a new video and do not forget to give me a thumbs up because it helps youtube to recommend my videos to others searching for similar videos so let's get started for today's hair growth video so the very first ingredient you'll be needing is your fenugreek seed guys fenugreek seed is rich in protein and nicotinic acid which are all known to be beneficial when it comes to hair fall dandruff hair dryness boldness and thinning hair okay fenugreek prevents uh hair loss and it strengthens your hair against scalp irritations and dandruff like i said earlier it adds shine to your hair and it prevents premature grain of your hair and promotes hair growth this is not the first time i'm using fenugreek so the next ingredient i'm using is my dry rosemary leaves you can use the fresh ones as well and um rosemary helps with uh improving uh, scalp blood flow circulation in your scalp thereby promoting growth it helps with boldness and it also help with uh, it help with bonus and stimulate new hair growth in your bowl areas okay it also helps with grain of hair promotes shine and reduces dandruff and it's a great great product for your natural hair so i'm going to steam it in the on the fire for five to ten minutes and i put um one and a half cup of water in the mix before putting it on the fire i forgot to say that and guys why my um fenugreek and my rosemary is boiling there i'll come back here and prep my my black soap which is from ghana i got it from an african store here who uh, owned by a ghanaian lady and this is where i got my black soap and this is original black soap from ghana it is very beneficial and great for your skin and your hair okay guys now this is going to help to make our hair growth natural diy shampoo so i use almost a a, a tablespoon of my um black soap and now i have removed my rosemary and uh, fenugreek tonic from the fire and I'm, I'm going to pour it inside this bowl so it will help my black soap to just melt okay so we are going to wait for a while and assist this by just mixing it and you realize while it is dissolving it becomes really black okay that is because it is called black soap so this is my natural diy shampoo that i use when my hair has a little bit of itchiness to my scalp when i feel i have build up when i feel my hair is so um packed with all that i want to remove and just dead on my scalp if you have all protective style that you have removed this shampoo is great to use because it will cleanse your scalp and your hair really nicely so i went ahead and just added some essential oils the first one was peppermint just a few drops the second one is lavender oil just to give it a boost of uh, other nutrients that my hair needs and it gives me that cool and calm sensation if I was suffering from itchiness on my scalp it's going to give me that cooling and calm sensation which I absolutely love I'll go ahead stir this and just wait for it to cool down a little bit and I'm going to transfer this into my spray bottle and the next time you'll be seeing me is during application time now if you're suffering from boldness uh, uh, hair breakage and hair fall shedding this shampoo is going to be great for you as well 
and if you are suffering from getting the perfect shampoo sometimes i'll recommend you make your own shampoo and try the natural one who knows this might be the solution to your problem and you are not going to regret it okay guys but this i will not recommend for you to use weekly basis because it is really purifying and it leaves your hair really clean and, and and nice okay so go ahead apply it on your hair go to the bathroom i just wanted to show you guys how this ladder up really nicely so if it was in my bathroom i'll first of all pour water on my strands but since i was not in the bathroom i just went ahead straight on my dry hair but it still came out really nicely so pour water on your hair first detangle and section your hair and start applying your shampoo normally i shampoo my hair twice concentrate more on the scalp first and i walk my way through the rest of the strands of my hair and you will not regret using this my hair right now is so calm after washing it and making this hair this voiceover and my hair is so cool and calm and clean and yes guys let me know your thoughts in the comment section if you enjoy using your own diy shampoos once in a while and this will help grow your hair beautifully and i'll see you guys in my next tutorial have just begun we will always take a stand for the people for the land let's go back to Savannah, I'm coming home, Savannah, we'll never be alone, Savannah, the beauty of the world, Savannah, let's all take a walk, Savannah.